Hey guys, it is Angel DeVille, and the kitten just woke up. Great. <laughs> Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. I don't want you awake, so if you're awake, then you're going to drive me crazy all day. Anyway, um, I wasn't able to do the video or a few projects I wanted to do the other day because I just... <sighs> I felt like crap. I really did. I didn't feel like doing anything last few days. I was doing fires a lot. Like, playing with fire and stuff like that. But that doesn't really, like, okay, I don't even really need this. I'm just going to skip to it. This is what I've done so far. Uh, this is what the, um, the paint and food color coloring looks like when it dries. I still need to add a little bit more stuff, but I'm not really in a painting mood. So this is going to be on hold for a little bit. I do want to add like little pops of color somehow. I don't know yet, but I'll figure that out. I need a stiff brush though to do what I want to do to it. <clears throat> so that's definitely something I want to do. I might try to go up later today possibly, but I've been walking non-stop the past few days. So me walking right now is not the greatest of ideas. Because altogether from here to unemployment is a six hour walk. Three hours to go up there and three hours to come back. So that's been pretty killer. Plus going, which I'm not complaining on this one. I actually kind of enjoyed this walk to an extent. Kind of ish. Like, minus natural paranoia. But um... Like an hour, maybe a half hour walk from my friend's job, which is way on the, way up the road. Like way up, way up, way up, way up there. I gotta actually do videos for you guys to show like, you know, these are my distances that I go every day, basically. <clears throat> but from there all the way down to where he lives, that was like an hour, half hour-ish walk, give or take. No. No, it's probably a little bit longer than that. It seemed like it was a lot longer than that, roughly. I don't know. I could be wrong, too. I'm actually, I'm becoming a fast walker, even with smoking. But thankfully, I'm quitting smoking. <laughs> even though today and tomorrow probably isn't the greatest of idea to go without, but I'll get over it at some point in time. Um, That's something I'm probably going to do one of these days for you guys to, like, you know, hey, this is what I have to walk every day and every night, so... Not really every day and every night, just like when I need stuff done, it's, yeah. Uh, I'm still working on this one. I still have yet to kill my cats. Come on, guys. I have yet to make the character on the back piece. I'm probably going to see if one, whoops. I'm probably going to see if one of my friends can do something for me. I'm not really sure who I'm going to ask on this one because I don't... I know. Oh, it's trying to chip away. Okay, I'm gonna have to do a top coat on here because it's like chipping away and stuff like that. But um, <clears throat> I have a certain image in my head that I want something down here in the corner. Probably not as big, but you know, a decent sized creature of some sort. And I just have like one arm coming up here, wrapping around the bars. But I don't really know how I'm gonna do that just yet. Ty. And the funny thing is, the reason why I started this video was because everybody was not up my ass. And as soon as I start the video, everybody has to be up my ass. I don't understand this. Ugh. Fucking allergies, I hate it. But this one I might actually ask for assistance. I'm going to spray this down real fast though with top coat with the hairspray in a little bit. Because I just noticed some of it was chipping away. And I don't really want that to all chip away. So, you know, I can't even really move because I don't technically have shorts on. Um, now that this dried, hopefully you guys can see it better. There we go. Hopefully you guys can see a lot of the details better. I Yeah, I see it now. Uh, this is one of the ones I'm going to be working on, actually, because it's not really done done. I like it how it is, but then it's like... Ugh, I could do so much more to this project. Like, and I can even add, like, little stuff to the window, possibly. I don't know yet. 
And then this one I was just like, I'm very happy with this now, now that the colors... Yeah, I actually like how this turned out now that I... <clears throat> now that everything actually like dry dried. And I got the green to go where I wanted it to. You know, you need sparkles. And this was just the glitter glue sticks that I used, so... That was, um... <laughs> Oh, I'm just gonna leave it there then. So that was, um, I like how this turned out. I have yet to mark it though with my signature or anything like that. And I'm not too sure where my thingies went. And if I get up, eh, it's not gonna end well. So I'm actually gonna toss him over here. So I know that's done. That, like I said, this is what I'm gonna be working on. Oh, I am so sorry. Mm. Yeah, I am so sorry, guys. Like, I have. I I literally have only been up for a little bit. So, and I'm not doing this as advertisement, but the orange vanilla Coca-Cola is probably the best. The best thing that they have out there right now, Coca-Cola-wise at least. I'm more of a Pepsi person. I'll always be more of a Pepsi person. I'm not going to fully say why I'm a Pepsi person, but I'm more of a Pepsi person. But for some reason, the Coca-Cola orange vanilla, it is like, it's blissful. It, it's like you're drinking the orange, uh, orange cream pops. Oh, God, it is so awesome. And my problem is, and the only problem is, is that they don't come in a two liter. They only come in this and then the cans. That is it. I'm upset about that, but I'll get over it. At least they have a 24 pack can wise and a 12 pack. I'm trying to think. I, I could be wrong on that 24-pack. I know I see a 24-pack of the orange somewhere, of the Coca-Cola orange somewhere, or is that the vanilla? That's one of the two. So fucking delicious. Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ah, I gotta take the game here. But, um, yeah, this is probably one of my favorites. I was drinking juice earlier, but, it's like, it's not really helping me with my weird thing in my mouth. I can't think right now. Uh, I'm actually going to switch it up from this, though. Because I do have my blissful bag of markers that... Actually, the doy, I could use my markers on the canvas piece. Duh. I'm just going to have to, like, write it on the back or something. <laughs> Oh, tomorrow I am going <sighs> to... Do you too, little missy. Anyway, tomorrow I'm going to try to cram in as much art projects as I can. Uh, so I don't have to deal with my thoughts. Because tomorrow is the 25th of April and I am not happy about that because it is the same exact day that my father passed away. So, I'm trying to avoid as much memory contact as possible. I don't know if that's really going to work out. I like to hope it is. I don't know if it's going to, but... Oh, those are olives I was eating? Oh. You know, I think after all this, I might go to the store. Because I just saw cheese on the back of the box. I'm like, oh, I want cheese now. Ooh, yeah, I'm definitely going to the store after this. Because technically, I've been up since 8 o'clock. <clears throat> but I just mostly laid in bed. I didn't really do anything. Because for some reason, I thought today was tomorrow. I thought today was Thursday, but it's actually Wednesday. So I'm expecting my unemployment check thing to come in. I was expecting my doctor to call me in the morning, my therapist. I was expecting to get some wash done because yeah, okay, it's summer. I have plenty of my summer clothes cleaned, but I don't have any of my winter clothes. Which, I already know how weird this shit's gonna get. So the faster I get all that stuff done, I don't have to worry about like, oh god, I have no jackets. I'm gonna freeze my arse off. 
No, I don't have to worry about that. Uh, so that was those things. Uh, uh, what else was I was going to do tomorrow? I have, like, I have, like, a lot of things that I have set up for tomorrow, but it's, like, I was thinking today was Thursday. So, like, might everything just, like, got smacked really hard and thinking, like, wait, my money isn't here yet. My doctor didn't call me in the morning because I kind of, like, passed out a little bit. So I woke up at, like, no. No. No, 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 no. I'm thinking about yesterday. Yeah, my brain is just completely destroyed. And I'm definitely going to need allergy medicine because I'm tired of itching my nose already and people already think I do drugs and I don't do drugs. I don't. I really, really don't. I just look like I do a lot of drugs by how I do my nose. But I can't help it because that's the only way I can actually get a satisfying itch done because of how damaged my nose already is from how many times I've rubbed my nose. I have like literally no cartilage here. Like, I got nothing. Like, it's just all just nothingness there now. Uh, 424? No, yeah. Yeah, 424.19. <laughs> it's so weird doing the stuff with the marker. It's like, I don't know what I'm doing. I think what really threw me for a loop is like all the weird scheduling unemployment has me doing because now they have me going through the, these workshops, like these classes and stuff like that. It's like, you know, how much knowledge do you know about your math? How, what are these riddles and these hidden, like all this dumb shit that doesn't even involve getting a fucking job. But it's like, oh, we gotta make sure you're going through everything. It's like people just fucking help me get a goddamn job. Don't tell me I have to go to Wilmington. Don't tell me I have to go to Newcastle because it's never going to happen. I hate Wilmington with a passion. I hate Newcastle with a passion. I had to think for a second. Because I do like Newcastle. I do. There are certain things in Newcastle that was fun having. <clears throat> um, a few people already know that story, thank God. I don't think it's a good idea to announce it on here yet. I don't know. If you want to know more what I mean by that, leave me a comment. I'll be more than happy to explain to you in a private message, I guess. I don't even know if I can do private messages. But we already know I'm a stoner. Like, we know I smoke weed from time to time, so... Yeah, that right there kind of should tell you something. <laughs> but other than that, I don't like Newcastle. I hate Wilmington with a passion because that's where all of my bullshit started. Hate women too with the passion. Especially Admiral's Club Apartments. I don't give a shit what the new name is now. That place and those apartments will always be known as Admiral Club Apartments. Basically, right off of Kirkwood. Kirkwood, I classify a part of as a part of Wilmington. I don't know why. It's not even fully connected to Wilmington, but if you go up the road a little bit, there's Wilmington, so it's like it's one of those things. It's not fully Wilmington, but it's not, yeah, it's not fully Wilmington, but it's Wilmington. It's really weird, but Delaware is a weird place anyway, so. And I'm right to back. So, Wilmington, this, this, yeah, fuck Wilmington. I will never go to Wilmington. I hated the fact that I had a job on Main, on Main Street. Wow, Main Street's that way. So it's technically Kirkwood, but Kirkwood's way up there that way. But no, I don't know. I hate the fact that I had a job there on Kirkwood. I liked the fact that I had a job, but I hated the fact that I had to be on Kirkwood. But at that point in time, I really didn't care much. I just, I needed a job. I wanted to get out of the situation I was in. Still in the situation that I'm in, because I wasn't thinking about saving up money like a dumbass. Yep. I pretty much did the same exact thing on Papa John's on Main Street, which is what I was trying to say, but that's also okay. And honestly, like, the more I'm saying all this shit, it's like, people are gonna realize where I live, or at least have, like, a rough ballpark of where I live, and it'd be my luck, my ugh, family is probably watching these, but I really, 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 really extremely doubt it, because, you know, 
the question mark of a whatever the fuck sister in law. She only knows about the one YouTube channel that I no longer do, which was like five, six years ago. Which is just me doing vocals, so nobody knows about this channel yet except for the new people and I'm proud of that. So I really doubt that my family is watching this. I wish my cousins were watching this now watching this though. Because Mike and Connie are like the only good cousins that I actually talk to or at least try to talk to but with how things have been lately it's like I don't really know what they are like what their schedule like what they're doing I don't really know if they're on vacation doing stuff I don't know if they're doing like I don't know if Connie's doing the kindergarten stuff still I don't know if Mike's doing school stuff with Carino I don't really know what's all fully going on with their life would you little spotlight she's like I just want love mom Anyway, I'm veering off way too much of my own family stuff. Um, if you want a family video and all that craziness, go right ahead. I'll be more than happy to do a video on just that. But I'm trying not to, like, combine too many things right now. And this pretty, 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 pretty... Okay, it's not even that pretty. It's just a bag. <laughs> this has, like, my nail polish in it and stuff like that. Which, I don't wear nail polish anymore like I used to. It used to be like an everyday thing at one point, or if it's like if I like one base color, I would use it for a while. So like, yeah. And at one point, I would do my middle fingers just one color if I knew I was going somewhere, and then my and my other nails would be total different colors. Or like one finger would be one thing, and like the rest would be bold. So yeah. at one point, I did like the red and black colors on my fingers to be red, black, red, black, red, black. Yeah. yeah I was. I don't know. I kind of enjoyed it for a while there. I like have no, not full many fake nails left. Um, but I do have some nail polishes left over. But I'm not going to use them all. I just want to use a few of them. And half of these, honestly, I didn't even buy. I really didn't. Majority of, I, majority of these I didn't buy. I think I bought... Hold on. Because one sinful color. Or guilty pleasure. I'm sorry. This was the only one that I bought. Was the guilty pleasure because it's gold. And back when I got this, it was like 2009, 2010. So AFI's Crash Love came out. And I have a thingy on my glasses that was bugging me. So AFI's Crush Love came out, and one of the music videos, uh, Medicate, yeah, Medicate, it was all gold, so Davy Havoc, of course, had gold nail polish on, so I had to get gold nail polish just to go with it, and I loved it. Um, I had silver, I don't know if I still have silver, I, I don't think I have my silver one anymore, no, because I would have seen it. But I did silver because of their 2000, because of AFI's 2003 Sing the Sorrow, Silver and Cold. And yeah, I had the gold and silver on my nails for a while there. And I know the lyric isn't wrap you in silver and gold. It's actually wrap you in silver and cold. But me not listening fully to it and like mishearing things. I always thought it was wrap you in silver and gold, so I would, yeah. <laughs> I would do like little silver crosses on my nails and then have the gold background. And I'm getting way too in these memories now, so I'm just going to shut up. But um, the reason why I said that is because I have a f oh, what I borrowed without her permission. I'm not going to say names, but... But certain people who have screwed me in my past, I wound up doing what they've done to me. I took what they, yeah. Anyway, but this is Sinful Colors, which I I actually love saying this because... Are we done breaking into stuff? Yeah? Awesome. I love Sinful Colors because they always have great vibrant things, or great vibrant tones. And this is just like a dark pink. The actual name of it is Cream Pink 152. I don't know why I'm doing this again. Yeah, so you guys can see it. 
I also have another one from them. It's a lot darker that I really love as well. Dream On 113, which I also love this color quite a bit. I, they kind of look the same at like at first glance for me at least until like I really look like this one's so much darker than this one. Which now this kind of makes me want to do my nails now. And then I have a lighter pink as well that I actually, I think I bought this one. Oh wait, they're both cream pink. What the hell? But that pink is so much darker than this pink. Okay, well apparently I have two cream pinks. But this one is so much lighter than this one. And then, okay, whatever. Just, oh, uh, wait a minute. I think I mixed some. Hold on. Yeah. I just remembered because I did have a thing for a while there where I was like mixing colors. Yeah, I'm definitely going up to the store after these videos. Well, this video at least, because... Oh, wait, these are all quick drawers. Never mind, I might be able to do a few of them. Because I do have a few things I want to do. Yeah. And I can't really do this upside down because the nail polish won't really look right to me. Oh, if you're using nail polish for anything... Please have a window open because this actually will do some brain damage to you. And I know some of the people that are on here that are, ah, screw it, I don't need my brain. Brain cells regroup, or regroup. <laughs> brain cells regrow. Not always. I'm a fool on stone and my brain cells will never die. Yeah, well, you know what? At a young age, like what I was doing, when I was nine, seven, you know, going back as a kid doing nail polish work, at least when mom and dad would let me, or at least when my mom would let me more, if I should say more of. Yeah, it's not a good idea. And as you get older, you start getting into paint and stuff like that. Yeah, no, you might want to work in some heavily ventilated areas. So don't do what I did growing up. Don't burn out your brain cells, because that's probably why I'm so messed up. Ah, nyet, 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 nyet. I'm not that messed up, but I do know I have some brain issues. And then me, like, you know, doing the painting, not having a window open, doing a lot of random stuff, and like, yeah. Me not taking care of myself and all that good stuff, yeah. I'm definitely the poster child of listen to warning labels. Sometimes. Sometimes listening to warning labels. It's like people say, don't eat raw meat. Steak tartare is raw meat. Thinly sliced raw meat, but raw meat nonetheless. Yeah. But just, just, you know, make sure you're working in a heavily ventilated area. Not even heavily ventilated area. Just make sure you're working in a ventilated area. Ventilated area. Ugh, that sounds so weird. And I have cats. So if I don't have a window open or something like that, I'm doing damage to them too. So that's not a good idea. Ugh. Ah! Well, you can kind of see how it's going so far. And these things are just like, they're so old. It's like, jeez. And it's kind of funny, the colors I showed you are the colors I'm going to be using. That's kind of funny. Um, I might, I kind of want to do nail art again. But I'm not really sure yet. <sighs> Jeez. But I'm not really too sure just yet if I want to do fake nails. Because I don't wear fake nails. And the nails I have done so far. Or at least recently have done. I'm like, I'm never going to wear them. 
Like, I might wear them at some point in time. But at the moment, that is a very hard pass, buddy. It was a very, very hard pass. And I actually do. I want to wear the nails that I've made, but I don't have the nail the glue for them. I don't even use nail glue. I just use crazy glue. I know it's not good for your nails, but I do do a top coat on my nails to protect them. So I do do the crazy glue. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm, excuse me. There's no actual like damage to the nail itself. So that is one thing I I do keep up with. As my cats run around the house trying to break shit. And not all of this is going to be perfect. I just want to add a different tech, like a different thing to them. A different color pop. Ah. Crap all over my legs now. And I'm going to finish with my pale blue. Which is actually a combination of a few blues. Like there's a dark blue in here. There's a light blue in here. There's a... Um... I'm pretty sure um, Sam's metallic mix is in here. Uh, there's like no name on it, just a number, and it's not even the number that it's supposed to be on here. Yeah, the metallic blue is definitely in here because it's like really faint. Guys, come on, you're making the bed shake. That's crazy. I can hear the car wash all the way over here. That's crazy. And I remember why I don't use the snail polish as much. Cause so I, I remember I have to like glob it on there and I don't like doing that technique. I think I've explained that before. Or, but it's like I'm wasting nail polish when I glob it but it's like sometimes you just gotta glob it on there If I don't glob it on there, it's not going to look right. Oh, I, there's something just onto my head. Um, also, I am going to be going to Lowe's. Because I'm a Lowe's girl. I hate the orange box, a.k.a. Home Depot. I will always be a Lowe's girl. I don't give a shit how much hate I get for that. I'm always going to be a Lowe's girl because of my daddy. That and I know majority of the people at Lowe's, so. But, um, back to the original subject. Um, I am going to be doing the can design fairly soon. I do have a kind of trunk to put them all in. 
So that is actually going to be tons of fun because, again, my dad was the concrete king. He used to work for a few concrete companies back in the day. And I'm going to start crying, so I'm just going to shut up right now. <clears throat> and more sinful colors. Um, this is it is the name of this one. This is kind of old, though, because it doesn't even have the SC on the top. <clears throat> but, um, I'm definitely going to be going to Lewis fairly soon. I wanted to do it during June, but I figured I might as well try to do it tomorrow if I can. A small thing of... I don't, I don't really want to call it concrete mix because it isn't technically concrete mix. It's more of like a filler. But um, it's only like $7, I think. It's probably $8 for a half a pound. Or $8 for a pound. I forgot what the other one was. But I'm getting the pound. It's only in like a decent size container. So, well... Yeah, a decent sized container, which I can easily carry in my bag. I don't really want to grab a, you know, an 80 pound bag of concrete mix when I really don't need that much. And it's only for a few cans. <laughs> Let's see, there's that can, there's those cans in the bag, there's all those cans. Yeah, I might actually have to get more of that. Yeah, I might have to get the bigger one. But um, I am definitely want to do some videos for that walk if possible. I really don't know. Um, I kind of want to ask for a ride up there, but I've been doing everything else on my own lately, so. And, like I've told David a few times that, you know, it was for the sake of art. And there was a reason why I'm doing all this crazy shit. It's because of, like, my love of art. And I think it would be kind of awesome to finally incorporate something of my dad into my art besides, you know wanting to like carve into wood and stuff like that because that was a lot of my like a lot of stuff my dad would do so uh yeah that is definitely something i want to lean into fairly soon you know i don't even want to go any further with that because i know the yellow isn't going to mix with any of it i thought that was orange <laughs> Oops. oh and the red and black ones i have those are mine like this one the Broadway which is definitely mine because I used to buy Broadway a lot yeah 23 and it's kind of funny because my roommate used all of my red nail polish for an art project he was working on so he bought me another one thank god it's not the right shade that I would normally use but he doesn't even know that so but it's cool with me I can easily just add a little bit of black nail polish in there and yeah and this is also another one that is mixed with a few different nail polishes. <clears throat> but I'm just at this point just going to do little bursts, so... It's funny, I was thinking about going to the store and it's like, I don't really even want to go to the store now. But I want cheese, so. <laughs> I think I might just go up to Dollar General, maybe? To go get Zai cheese, because it's really, really close and I don't have to worry about walking too far. But they don't have mozzarella cheese. So it's kind of like. Uh, it's one of those things. Like you do want it. But you, you don't want to go for that long walk to get it. And it's not even that long of a walk. It really isn't. It's like a few minutes away from where I live. It's like it's not even that much of a walk. But it's like. like don't want to keep walking. And like, I know there's some food service apps 
Like, you know, they give, you give them your shopping list, they bring it to your house thing. I know that, but it's like... To me, that's like ultra lazy. I'm lazy, but to me, that's like ultra lazy. If you don't even want to get up to go to the store to do something, then just, you know, wait until tomorrow to get it or something. I, like, I kind of understand it, though, like, for elderly people, so I understand why they have it out there, but, my God, it's so fucking lazy. Anyway, this is what we got. It's a nice little burst of color. Kind of like how it turned out a little bit. I'm not going to really, I'm, like, I need to wait for it to dry more, because once it dries, it goes to a very nice matte color. Um, yeah, my... <laughs> My funky finger glitter is kind of going cruddy. I don't even know where to get this from. I found it on the side of the road, actually. Oh. Oh. Ugh. So, I'm not... If you guys know where to get funky fingers from, the nail polish, that'd be awesome. Because I actually like their colors a lot. I've seen them once in a store, but I can't remember where I saw it. The only thing I remember when I saw those in this, in one of the stores was I was with my roommate, Kurt, roommate. I would call him my ex, but I refuse to even think about it at this point. So just like, you're my roommate. I was with him. I was, it was right before my dad passed away. No, I'm sorry. No, it was, at, it was shortly after. Yeah, wow. Well. I'm just going to quickly round it all up. I want to say it was roughly in 2016, maybe 2017 is when I saw them in a store. And at that point, I was doing a lot of art, like going out and getting a lot of art supplies and stuff like that. So it's like, it was one of the weird stores. I think it was one of the ones Small Fry showed me. But I also could be wrong on that. I don't even talk to her anymore. Because, you know, a lot of bullshit happened between his little group of bullshit friends and then what I believe in. So. Or my views. Because apparently my views are so harsh and should never be spoken about. And, uh, and people are assholes. That's why I don't talk to any of them and I refuse to go out with them. And they don't even ask me anymore if I want to hang out. So, like, it kind of all works out for me. But, anyway, I'm not going to dwell too much on the past. Because I have Skittles, I have Ice Cream Sandwich, I have Bill, I have Brian, I have... Ha! I have Sabrina. Uh, really nice girl, she works up at the Walgreens that I occasionally bounce into when I need something. I can even go in there, but again, I really want mozzarella. Mozzarella. So, uh, I'm actually going to put this away. And because I know I haven't eaten anything yet, that's actually what I'm going to go do, is get some grub. And, um, I will actually, I'll actually be back. I'm, like, now I'm thinking about it, I'm probably not going to go to the store because I have what I need here, basically. But, like, that cheese. I need to resist the cravings is what I need to do, more so than normal. But, um, I do have a little bit of stuff that I do. Yeah, and, ooh, I'm going to Dollar General. I know where I'm going. <laughs> I just satisfied the cheesy need and the cheap thirst. Or, and the cheap need. Because I don't have much money. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm veering off on food and stuff like that again. I probably shouldn't do all that. So, I will see you guys in a little bit. I'm not going to be that long. I shouldn't be that long. If I am that long, I feel really, really bad for them, but I shouldn't be that long. Um, when I come back, I am going to finish the water painting. I am going to be finishing this up when I come back. I might do a few little side videos on like where I'm going. I don't like calling them vlogs, but this might actually turn out to be one of those weird things. I don't really know just yet. I'm hoping it doesn't, but it might. Um... So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.